Zacho Omotesa Dumelang I'm a Natalie guy <laughs> Welcome to our brand new episode of The Real Talk with myself Fezilele Panaki Simens here on Epic Vision Entertainment the home of unemployment solutions Oh yes people we've been hearing a lot of um, comments on social media about DJ's book going back to work I see too. Yeah, so um, most of the hustlers um, are complaining, saying DJ's boo are disappointing. You know, DJ's boo is a sellout. Um, DJ's boo has been saying, good, hey, uh, employment is a stop, or be rich, employment is what and what. Now, DJ's boo, the same DJ's boo is going back to employment. They are not today. Like, how can you do this? To us, hot money. Um, that's what a lot of people are saying. So now I'm here to give you guys my thoughts about this whole thing. Yeah, DJ Spoo. Some people are saying, Guti, um, DJ Spoo is broke. Uh, that's why he's going um, for employment. But like, guys, come on. Let's start here. Um, there is levels, levels in being broke, you know. Um, some of us, we are broke when our bank accounts are saying zero, zero. And then there are those people who will say, Hi, yes, Angina Mali, I am broke when their bank accounts are like a thousand rand left. You know, and then there are those people, Banama, hundred thousand in their account. And then when they see a uh, hundred thousand in their account, they'll be like, Oh, God, I am broke, Angina Mali. You see, there are levels. There are those people who are about millions. Can be saying artists taking about three, five million. Say accounting now, you know Hey, you know I'm broke because of the lifestyle each individual is living. Umuntu would say, "Could take care my lifestyle is so so." Mangilana, I know could this money won't maintain me for a long time. So I am broke. and am not you know, so being zero zero broke and being broke, yaba nyaba nto ba fana na boti DJ's blue. DJ's blue means uguti. I am broke, but I can still maintain my life until this level. But then, guys, we, we, we cannot be talking about DJ's blue who is broke now. You know, um, he's been preaching in the in the way, um, multiple income streams of the same DJ's blue. And DJ Spoo has been preaching in the way, following your passion, doing what you love, you know, and all that. So now, Masi uh, Chonga Emuva, um, there is entrepreneurship space that uh, DJ Spoo has been within or Kuyo for a long time, uh, pushing more fire, um, doing properties business uh, property businesses and all that and that's one of the things he have passion for entrepreneurship making money having multiple income streams and the third income stream will be uh, the hustle corner because um youtube is paying people buffet too for pushing content when your channel is on some level at you can monetize your channel and get paid so buffet too we are talking about dj spoo who's currently having three income streams which i don't think um all of them can fail him for us to say guti dj Spoo is going back to radio because of he is broke so that one i think that one it does not work at all so now my thought yo guti why dj Spoo went back to a radio um few years back um, there was a short course of entrepreneurship that I was doing. Wow. So um, one of the mentors um, on that course um, said to us, Uguti, he said something similar to what DJ Spoo used to say, Uguti, if we, um, we leave our businesses and go look for a job, we would have um, failed ourselves and our businesses. A taller lady. So, Failing ourselves and our businesses, and then Lanto Yonki Shali and Hey man, 
uh, I can't give up on my business. But now the problem is the business that you are pushing currently cannot afford to maintain your life. And unabantua. So the person is saying this in the Bayoguti, Yena he is employed. He is employed on a salary, a good salary every month. And then on a business yake aside that he's pushing. So um it is easy for, for him to say those words, which vele um those words they don't mean anything bad. Yeah, well, because vele you would have um uh, failed you yourself and your business by by letting go of um a business you can go look for a job but it depends ukutina what is it that you do because by fe to nani neyazi uguti um if utenge inyama eningi and you you could not um cook yonke ikona leza ushieka uifache friji inga bowli so that's what we do with our businesses or ideas you take your idea, you put it inside the fridge, in a bowl, you will come back to it. You go look for a job so that you'll be able to have an income as a maintainer. While on that income, there is a portion. It is not mine. And he has a portion, like, that portion we take and keep on investing in your in your business so maybe if your business is the services that you could um do on your laptop or on your phone um like guys come on why not um continue doing your services over your phone or over your laptop ngama lunch time or after work uphanenge services sakho while u busy uphangela from 9 to 5 the aim is not to um leave your business but to go look for to go grind for a funding is our kulisa e business which is this employment but in dj's boost story it's a different um thing from lay and tatan gayo I mean, i'm talking about this in the level year two the hustlers who are still growing the small businesses the startup businesses you are born because you are pushing your business and you are born to take okay, fine i'm making sales but now the problem is I'm pushing a hand to mouth business because now the money that I'm making it's only enough to maintain in Piloyam Nabam and nothing for the business. And I cannot say I want to grow a business while I am hungry. No, saving money to grow my business in Lambi, I want to I cannot do that. Like that that's not fair to me and everyone I love. So Iba in like in the business cool. So what do you do? What do you do? What do you do? You go look for a job, you find a job, and then you have this portion in jails out. You know this one? I don't know this portion. Manuticular business. If you busy because after work, we end those services for people and they keep on paying, make that money. Now it's a good thing. So now at least you'll be having two income streams, even if your business is not making much money, but you know Guti month end you have something that gets in your account that can maintain impilo yako in impilo yabantu anabako or kanye people that you love so now for utj's boo like i said before bafetu um he already have three um uh, income streams utj's boo have more fire teachers boo have um a property business that is pushing and then utj's boo has this um the hustle corner podcast which we, whereby a, a, a youtube is paying him something there is something is getting a utinayo imfakeli mali nyana etile yokuthi at least nyana naya kwazi ubona ukuthi uhlanganisa izinto zakhe njani so now dj's boo nanko he's an entrepreneur and then he's been doing entrepreneurship and hustling for years including the hustle corner and all those we put them in one entrepreneurship all that he's been doing this for years but the problem is there is this one thing, a short dial. Guys, I love your radio. Sure, your podcast is something close to radio, but like, it is not like radio. I love radio as DJ's boo. So I have a lot of passion and love for, like, that's my first love, a radio. So I tried massive radio, um, things did not go well, you know. So here is an opportunity, uh, SABC and, and Kasha. Like, our guys, you see, so now DJ's boo, we are talking about four income streams as, as is our cool DJ's boo now. So 
Linda by Yokuti is broke. I think we should put it aside. Ayiko, Ayiko, like totally. There is no such thing as DJ's book being broke. DJ's book na kuya kwam. Even though Dinga Kaboni any um comments ezake about this whole thing, Yokuti na um answering the the complaints and um he, he, he complaints from other people. I think na my thought are uh, DJ's book just went back to a radio because he loves a radio. That's all. So we just pray in Jehokuti, he will manage to maintain in the radio, in the podcast, and all other businesses. But yeah, to Otleva I believe and I believe Ukuti uh, before he signed the contract he had all his affairs um Zibekyo and Gentlela right. Ukuti Makangeko in Toniza Kwazu and Zango Bani Pinjani. So DJ's boo on my closing, um, it's someone lokuti akafuni u umlandele unamele. Like you don't follow DJ's boo u unamele. You see, when you, you want to follow DJ's boo, you must you, you must be mundo patient. Sit back, let him walk at least a six to seven steps ahead of you, um and follow and follow his footsteps. That's DJ's boo. That hot money, clever blind. That hot money, clever blind. But anyway, guys, yeah, that's it for today. What are your thoughts about this whole episode here today? Talking about DJ's boo. The number one, ha, huh, man. Yeah. So, uh, don't forget, please, man. Please do subscribe on our YouTube channel. Click the notification button. Click the thumbs up if you loved the video. I will really appreciate that. You guys are watching the real talk with myself, Ophezile. Le Panaki Simens. Apaku Epic Vision Entertainment, the home of unemployment solutions. Yo, guys, I'll see you on the next one. I love you so much. Bye bye. Salute. The real talk with Fez. So you know it hits. Yeah.